So here's a quick video on something I ran into on uh, my Vortex. I bought a car used and I was having an issue with my receiver and my transmitter. I wasn't getting very good distance out of it. I'd get about 100 feet and then I'd just lose it. Come to find out what, what the issue was, is I got to tearing it apart. The guy I bought it from, this antenna wire was a little boogered up. Now it's still got connection, but I believe this is a coaxial wire. I'm not 100% sure on that. So what did I end up doing? Well, you know, you can go buy a new receiver or you can maybe take a look at it and see if you can get it fixed. I ended up taking the receiver box apart and in here you can see this is the antenna wire coming into it. This is a coaxial type of a thing. I'll try to get a better picture of it. I don't know if you can see the end here what goes in here, but it's it's almost like a you know a cable coaxial you'd have on your house for a TV. There's a center prong and then there's an outside area. This antenna I was able to find at a local hobby store. I was never able to find anything like this um, through Arma or any parts number or anything like that, but it's got a small in insert in the middle of it and then it's got the outer uh, shielding. So I was able to go through the local hobby shop and I just took this antenna with me and they found one. I think it come off of a plane would be my guess. And they just matched it up and I was able to get a new um, antenna, hooked it up to the receiver and started working perfectly. So if you, you've got a little bit of a receiver issue, um, check your antenna for your distance because that's more than likely what's going on. You could have a bad receiver, but... This was definitely an antenna issue. The guy must have got it to, got this wire inside the receiver box when he tightened it down and it kind of crimped it and tore the shielding on the outside. I could get about 100 feet and then I'd lose it. So what I ended up doing, again, I went to the local hobby shop, took this antenna with me. It's kind of a special looking thing and they matched it up. And I think the antenna came off of a plane, but it's some sort of a strange coaxial deal. I wish I would have saved the part number, but I didn't. So just something you might look into instead of throwing the receiver away, maybe replace the antenna if you can find one.